How's it going guys? My name is Sideswipe and in today's video I have got a very exciting wheel review to be showing you. This wheel is iconic and has been around for a very, very long time. It literally shaped the 80s in the roller skating scene. It was a wheel that I used to use when I was a kid and I absolutely fell in love with it. But sadly I haven't been able to get any as there hasn't been any in stock. But I must say a massive thank you to Ollie Skate Shop for setting me up with these wheels and also providing the wheels in today's video as they now have them in stock and ladies and gentlemen I'm so pleased to announce that today's video I'm going to be reviewing the Sims Street Snakes now these wheels are iconic and when I was a kid I used to absolutely love skating on these wheels they just feel amazing and I know a lot of people that are watching this probably remember these wheels when they were growing up but if you're a new skater today I'm going to be showing you what these wheels are all about so without ado let's open them up and let's see how good these wheels actually are or is it all just nostalgia check out these wheels these wheels are looking fresh and I cannot wait to put these on my bowels the new sims street snakes have come up with an improved core and they've literally solved all of the issues that the old original Sims used to have. It's a 78 hardness wheel, so it's an indoor outdoor wheel, perfect for both, and it's also a 62 millimeter size. So it's slightly smaller than the Airwaves, which is perfect for like your jam skating and dance skating, I think. Having a smaller wheel is a lot better for those kinds of things and personally I love dance skating, I love jam skating so from what I remember using these this is going to be wicked. I love the two-tone design, there's something about the two-tone design that just looks badass. I really like that especially like when the wheels are rolling. Now they are available in different colours, you can get black, red, green and black, blue and black and uh, Ollie's Skate Shop exclusive purple and black and now the purple and black ones you're not going to be able to get anywhere else and now i'm going to be going for a street skate around the city and the great thing about london is there's so many interesting roads and interesting paths you have smooth paths like this one and you've got some of the worst roads in the uk in london as well so we're going to be seeing how these wheels handle uh, on a street skate if you guys have seen my london roller skating video uh, that really popped off on YouTube a few years ago when I did that. I want to change the route up a little bit because obviously I've skated London for many years now and the route has changed. There's so many different routes around London. Um, but yeah, hopefully today we should be doing about 30 miles on these wheels. So that will give us a good idea of if these wheels are worth using and how good these wheels actually are. And now for the moment of truth. Oh, damn. Okay, they feel really cool. <laughs> I'm gonna have so much fun with these. They're really bouncy, they're really sticky, and they feel really, really nice. So uh, let's go, let's go for a street skate. Macaroni, hold down your fort when I get bold, kids bold. I spit more pain than a babble 
bills Go. I flip like Mexican jumping beans on trampolines They can't figure me, I put more disguises than Halloween MCs, y'all think I got wings? I'm the Venus fly trap with flows Remove my socks and get shot by my missile toes You know how it goes, true that La la, I laugh at all these whack MCs Ha 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 Rhymes tap your head up to goose Loose with talk, get chopped up for two parts With the chicken horn, scribe the boat of rape Rhyme with the dagger, cloak the tire Hip and roll, top to the tire Cause I do that, who that, do that Yo, it's the puppets, kids, say it, who that? Cause I do that, who that, do that? Yo, it's the scholars, kids, say it, who that? Cause I do that, who that, do that? Yo, it's the scribes, kids, say it, who that? Cause I do that, the puppets do that. So raise your hands in the air, say it, who that? This is no I'm the genie when you rub the lamp. I'm wetting kids, like Frosty the snowman in summer camp. I'm fed, whack them seeds are dead, fill them full of... So, <laughs> I didn't want to do that to be fair. But yeah, I thought when I put these wheels on that they're not as big as the airwaves. So I thought, oh, I'm going to struggle on the street, especially on rough ground. I, I've noticed on rough ground, it does slow me down a little bit more. But when I'm turning, I feel like I can turn so much quicker. And I feel like it's only a slight adjustment. But when I was jam skating and dance skating, I feel like it's a lot more fluid on these wheels rather than what I've tried previously. So that's really nice. But yeah, they feel really good. So... And um, for dance skating and jam skating, as you just saw, yeah, they feel really smooth. I really like the grippiness of the wheels. The control of the wheels is really good as well. And I've noticed because it's slightly smaller than the airwaves, you actually turn a lot faster than you would on the airwaves. I've noticed that. And I feel like movability and transitions is a lot easier on the Sims as well so far. But yeah, anyway, we've only skated for about, I don't know, 30 minutes, so not even that long. And, but yeah, I just thought I really wanted to skate here mainly because of that like you don't get much of this in london like there are places to go where you do find smooth spots like this but i think this is a special treat especially with this big monument behind us or temple after skating for a few days on these wheels then something magical happened it started to rain and i was very surprised on how these wheels reacted in the wet weather they were extremely grippy i didn't feel like i was sliding all over the place i felt like i had a lot of control and this really really did surprise me but i had so much fun and these wheels reacted very very well i was doing power slides i was doing jam skating spins and i just had full control over my skating i noticed after i skated in the rain that these wheels went from being a two-tone wheel to a free tone wheel, which I wasn't expecting. So as you can see here, this bit's black, this bit there is blue, and then right on the top, it actually turned green. And for me, that was quite cool. It was like having those Hot Wheels cars where when you put water over them, they change color. Now, I wouldn't recommend skating in the rain in general, but if you're one of those skaters that does like skating in the rain, just like I do, then you're gonna have a lot of control and a lot of movability. Um, now, my bearings didn't seize up. I was skating in the rain for a good, I don't know, two hours, and the bearings held up really well. The bearings in these wheels are the Enough 
ABEX 7 bearings. They're pretty standard bearings. They're not the worst bearings, but they're not the best bearings. They're pretty standard. I'll probably end up putting some Bones Reds in these bearings. They're just my favourite bearings going, really. Um, but yeah, overall, my overall experience, these wheels are a must-have if you are a quad roller skater, especially if you're somebody who likes skating the streets, jam skating, and just overall enjoy their skating experience and if you're somebody that skates airwave and you're after a wheel or a different wheel to try out i would highly recommend this wheel now i still really do like my airwaves i've been skating on airwaves for the last five years and i think i've just found my new favorite wheel these wheels are just something else i'd recommend these wheels to anybody that is skating on the streets they're just the perfect all-round wheel for jam skating, street skating, and just general enjoying your skating experience wherever you are. Now, I did notice on rough ground, they're not as good with dealing with it as, say, a different wheel. But other than that, on nice smooth surfaces and on decent ground and decent terrain, these wheels perform really good. And I did take them all over London and I did test them out on different terrain. Now, a few roads were completely ruined and I think any skater on any wheel is going to struggle. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Now, if you guys do want to get yourselves some street snakes, you can head over to the link in the description and head over to Ollie Skate Shop if you fancy getting yourself a set. I personally think they are great wheels and I'm not being paid to say this, this is completely my own opinion and it's really good to be skating on these wheels again. Now I haven't skated on these wheels for 10 years and I'm so glad that I'm back on these wheels. So you're going to be seeing me skate on these wheels a fair bit. Now do I still like the airwaves? Of course I like the airwaves, nothing wrong with the airwaves but personally right now I'm in love with these wheels. If you are new around here, please hit that subscribe button for more skating tutorials. And if you did enjoy this video, please drop it a like. If you have got any questions regarding these wheels or anything skating related, and I will be sure to reply to any questions that you guys might have in the comments down below. My name is Sideswipe. Thank you so much for watching. Keep rolling and I'll catch you in the next one.